Lynn Selby, the executive director of the Caroline Center, thought she was just doing a normal interview about her organization. And really preparing the wonderful women of Baltimore City for careers in allied health. She explains the importance of their work in the community. The women here train for 15 weeks in either certified nursing assistance or pharmacy tech. But then... We actually have a really, really cute little surprise for you. Turn around. Good morning. <laughs> A lot of excitement as the Caroline Center celebrates its 25th anniversary. Bank of America has awarded the group $200,000. This gift is really a gift, a future or a forward-looking gift for Caroline Center. We've done such great work for the past 25 years. But as I said, as you think about strategic planning and the need of women in Baltimore, and how one of the things I like to say, we don't want to just be in the community, we want to be of the community. But the Caroline Center will receive more than just money. But also it comes with leadership training both for the executive director and an emerging leader. And so that capacity building along with the funding really is a differentiator. And that's not it. Bank of America made a second stop to Civic Works. I need you to turn around just real quickly. Okay. Dana. Oh, wow. Oh my Congratulations. gosh. Congratulations. You are one of Bank of America's 2021. Oh my gosh. Neighborhood uh, wow. Hey, wow, hey, this hey, is hey, great. Hey. Thank you so much. <laughs> wow, what a great surprise. Civic Works is Baltimore's Urban Service Corps and AmeriCorps program with a mission to strengthen the community through job training and volunteerism. It will enable us to get technical assistance for all different parts of Civic Works and expand our capacity and provide more training and service opportunities for folks in the communities. Civic Works just celebrated its 1,000th graduate of the Center for Sustainable Careers in October. Reporting in Baltimore, Lacey Griffith, WBAL, TV 11 News.